and his favor. We are here once again. And I want to say this. I said it yesterday. Everything started on Friday. And everything ended on Sunday. This is why a lot of you know believers, Christians, they are missing the fruit of Easter and the purpose of Easter. You know why? They always treat Easter like one of the holidays. Easter is not a holiday to you as a child of God. It is a platform where you need to position yourself so that God can see you and say, my son, my daughter, your sins are forgiven. It is no longer Jesus again to go on the cross. It is now you to crucify this flesh. He has done it. That's why he said it is finished. Anyone that believes in him shall never be put to shame. There is no need for us to be tradition when it comes to Easter. Look at your life. Are you really celebrating Jesus in the spirit? Or you are celebrating Jesus in the flesh? Jesus I know is Jesus in the spirit. The one you know in the flesh cannot solve your problem. He came to introduce a spiritual life to you so that you can overcome these fleshly things that are misleading our life. People want to be rich. People want to make money. People want to do all kinds of evil and they are forgetting about the life they are using. I thank God that he has given me that understanding. I thank God that he has given you that and for you to be here, you understand what is Easter. And my prayer is that as long as you are here and those who are watching, be the partakers of this. It's high time, people of God. We change the way we celebrate Easter. It is not a traditional thing. That's why if you see me every year, I don't preach like, oh, what are you going to get out of that? It is you now to crucify the sin in your body and be the follower. Remember, Christian, the word Christian came from the word Christ. If you call yourself a Christian, you are saying you are a follower of Jesus. If you say you are a Christian, you are a follower of who? What Jesus know about you, he knows you as his believer. So, are we going to continue like this? Celebrating Easter, like you, the way they celebrate uh, whatever. No. Easter, it is something different with what people are celebrating here on earth. I'm standing here, and I'll prove you that he came by the power of the Holy Spirit. And he said, I will not leave you as orphans. I will ask my father to give you another helper, the comforter, the spirit of God whom the world cannot see because they don't know him, but you, you know him. What sustained Jesus here on earth is what he came to introduce to you. Are you getting the point? He did not come to show you that I'm very strong, no. He came to show you, I mean, to give you this platform to say, this is the way you are going to live. If you live like this, you overcome the world. You become unstoppable. You live like me. You understand life beyond what you are going through. Look at me now. Even someone who was eating with me, I regard him as my disciple. He turned against me. He's talking to me that even you, there will be people who will be turning against you. There will be people who will be conspiring against you. As long as you are depending on them, 
you'll be disappointed. You'll lose focus and miss heaven. He said, look at me. All my disciples will run away by the time the enemy of salvation will bounce on me. They will run away. He explained everything even before. He said, we are going to Jerusalem where everything written about the Son of, the Son of God or the Son of Man will be fulfilled. The Son of Man will be handed over to the high priests, the elders, and the teachers of the law. They will beat him, spit on him, and kill him. But after three days, he will rise again. I understand Easter beyond my situation. Praise the Lord. My main point, the, what I want to introduce to you is what is giving me a problem with your understanding. Jesus came to show you the way to live here on earth. The way to defeat Satan. The way to defeat witchcraft. But you are not ready. You are ready to talk about his death. You are ready to talk about the way they killed him. You are ready to talk about the way they treated him. That is not the way you know you are supposed to celebrate Easter. Be the partakers of the results. Can you allow someone to treat you the way they treated Jesus? Be the partakers of the results. Hmm. This is the message I want to bring to you now. Mark chapter 1. Verse 9. Let me call you. At that time, Jesus came from Nazareth in Galilee and he was baptized by John in the Jordan. Verse 10. Just as Jesus was coming out of the water, he saw heaven being turned and opened, and the spirit descending on him like a dove. Come on, people of God. There must be a sign when you follow, I mean when you believe in Jesus. Jesus did not walk here on earth the way we walk and confess Christ with our mouth. Without the sign. Even his baptism, heaven opened. And the Spirit of God descended on him. A witch doctor will be blacking, challenging Christians. A satanist will be blacking, challenging you to say, if your God can bless you, look, you are poor. You are what? Why? What can identify you to be Jesus' disciple is the power of God in you. Forget about this, uh, what, I'm a child of God, I was born again. This, you have never experienced the power of God. You are not sure whether you go to heaven or you just be here on earth. Hmm. Let me lead this one. Are you there? Listen to this one. At that time, Jesus came from Nazareth in Galilee and was baptized by John in the Jordan. Just as Jesus was coming out of water, he saw heaven being turned or turned and opened, and the Spirit descending on him like a dove. What is the meaning of that? Strengthening him giving him support spiritually. No one saw what Jesus saw on that particular day. Even those who were there, they could not see except him. Spiritual eyes are not given to anyone except to those who receive the Holy Spirit, who are in contact with the heavenly Father. You can say you are a man of God, a human of God, by title, but you have never experienced the power of God. The work of the pastor is a very dangerous work. 
the spirit of God came upon his life. He became more powerful. Tell me, if the spirit of God came upon your life, when you acknowledge his death on the cross of Calvary, if demons will sit down inside your body and continue disturbing you, what surprises me is that even those who are claiming to be Christians or believers, they are the ones who are carrying spirit of anger and forgiveness. They believe so much in what they want to see. As long as they could not see what they want to see, everything that you are doing, even the word of God will become what? Useless. Hmm. Listen to this. After the spirit of God came upon his life, and the voice came from heaven, you are my son, whom I love, with you, I am well pleased. Tell me why God cannot use you. The word which is coming from the mouth of God, confirming that Jesus truly is the son of God. And he came to solve our problem. You are my son, whom I love. With you, I am well pleased. His walk here on earth, yes, people could see him walking, but he was more in the spirit than in the flesh. His understanding here on earth was not in the flesh, but in the spirit. People can talk about him, even when you are whispering, he will perceive, I know what you are talking about. If church were to be empowered by God Almighty, you can just run from your home and say, I'm going to church. The Spirit of God is there. The Spirit of God lead me to go to church. Before you know it, solution has come. Hallelujah. Listen to what the Holy Spirit now did to him. This is 12. At once, the Spirit sent him out into the wilderness. The Spirit did what? Send him in the wilderness for how many days? 40 days, 40 nights. 40 what? Days and 40. Who was protecting Jesus? The same Spirit. Listen to this before I, 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 I learn. Listen to this. And he was in the wilderness for 40 days and being tempted by Satan. He was with wild animals and an angel. Let me not take you there first. <laughs> there he was tempted by who? By Satan. We are celebrating Easter today. If you know you say Jesus is your father and you acknowledge and recognize is suffering because of your sin. Temptations will no longer be active in your life. I mean, nothing can tempt you and bring you down. Because Jesus is showing you that this is the way to live. Mweba and Abandi. Nisha chitile poechi wina ngutimole lo. Ameshu ale chitashani. Yale nkonka. Nisha kongwele kumuntu. Nisha tukidi omuntu. Nisha ibiri omuntu. Na nishile mkuka kulo muntu. Lelo wale mbepesha. So ifinala milanga. This is the way to live. For you to live a joyful life. So that at the end of the day you see heaven. There he was tempted. By who? Do you know temptation? Temptation could be money. Temptation could be women. Temptation could be beer. Temptation could be anything, foolish things. Satan can use any method to mislead you. Take advantage of Easter so that you make money. Don't go to church. If the Spirit of God is not there, you will see it as an opportunity. Not knowing that 
you are tempted by Satan and you obeyed Satan to lead your life and your business, you are there. Listen to this. This is my point. The same 13 b He was with wild animals. When the Bible says wild, wild animals, it means lions were there. Snakes were there. All kinds of animals were But they could not harm him because he is the source. A lion, you see Jesus say, ah, the master is here. <laughs> you know, my church is so good. You don't know this. So, Snakes are sleeping inside your stomach. You are claiming that you are a child of God. Hmm? Tiger are inside your body. Then you are claiming that you are a child of God. Spiritual husband or spiritual wife is telling you every night when you wake up and say, I'm a child of God. Hmm? Sometimes you say, Let's go to Mulenga. Can't you finish that Munja Sukila? Masankanya, let's <laughs> talk about TV Joshua. You combine, you know, the two so that at least if Mulenga got a quiet less, at least TV Joshua and Adi Mwena. Before you know it, they are feeding you, they are flogging you. You wake up and say, Jesus. Ah, what kind of prayer that I came? Okay, let me go to the prophet. Hello? And the way you, you, you know you, you address men of God, if you want, you know, to, to deceive them, servant of the most high God. <laughs> so that the man of God can prophesy about your problem. Hmm? Ah, Jesus. The answer is here. I told you that you need to learn how to call the name Jesus. If you call the name Jesus according to his spirit, immediately answer will land in your body. That's why I've entitled this journey, our three days journey, the power of spiritual what? Prayer. If I say the power of spiritual prayer, I'm talking about the power of spiritual life. A spiritual man or woman is more powerful than a rich man without the spirit of God. A servant of God with the spirit of God inside, he can, you know, control the world because the spirit in him is God Almighty. People may not believe in what he's saying, but what is coming out is the reality. Listen to this. Let me conclude. He was with wild animals. And an angel attended to, this is where my problem is. I said, Father, so anywhere where your son or a child of God may be found, your angels must be there to attend to you. Read the Bible. I'll give you the scripture. Even in Luke 4, when Jesus was tempted, you discover that Satan had left him and the angels attended to him. The one I, I shared with you yesterday, the same thing. The angels appeared to him. What can destroy human being is in the spirit. What can save the human being is in the spirit. Your fellow human beings cannot destroy you. But with the spirit of Satan inside them, they can harm you. When you pray, have you ever seen the sign of God Almighty in your life? Have you ever seen God working in your life? Have you ever experienced the touch of the Holy Spirit? Have you ever heard him tell him that this situation will come to an end? Have you ever heard that? S 
Stop thinking about Think about the way you behave, the way you live here on. He has done it already for you. It is now you to connect yourself to his life. He came to introduce his spiritual life to you, human beings, so that you can overcome spiritual problems that are using the flesh. You pray, you fast. You have done all kinds of fasting. You pray, you fast, and you have done all kinds of what? Fasting. But you could not see or hear. And there are people who came with that zeal to say, I want to follow you. Today, they have gone back to the whole life. What they vomited, they are eating now. What do you expect? Disaster. I had a vision today when I was praying. I saw one, one of us. I said, Jesus, help us. This is not good. This is not good. Help us to redeem our fellow uh, believers. Don't let them fall under the trap of the enemy in the name of doing business. Jesus must be part of your business. Nga mwa pepa, mwa pepa, kwa tifura pimba, nga tuwa mi pepa. Le sate wako itafechi ite ite. Le sate wako ite, nga wamu ita, ende la mission. Nga isa pari life yobe, afwire amboku mwonefi musekesha. Afwire amboku mfwefi mutemuna. Not you all if you know, and I let me after the mutemuna. He will leave you and say, Okay, live with your honor because they honor you, they respect you, they fear you. Let me see how you live this here on earth. He came to introduce you to the spiritual life. Snakes are always sleeping inside our body, you can't even sleep properly. You cannot sleep from Katushi Gumalanga, why did we come with Charona Chim? You are from which I understand. Now we are hospital, we have a man of that. When I'm with you, we know. But when we know them for the Shishan, we can't go. A snake cannot stay where the Spirit of God is settled. Demons were scared. Gabamun of Jesus, I say, Oh. Son of the Most High God, please don't destroy us. Don't destroy us. But when you, you confess, I'm a child of God. I am no longer a slave to sin. I am. Come. I'm waiting for you. I am a child of God. I will enter your stomach or your waist today. I'm no longer. Because I'm not going to be here. I'm no longer a slave to sin. I am a child of God. Python waiting for you. I'm not going to be here. I'm not going to be here. I'm not going to be here. Satan I'm inside. Stop confessing that before I invite Lion to come and eat your heart. This is what is happening to you. Jesus never, never confessed failure or defeat. Even to the point where Satan is not challenging his stomach to say, if truly you are the Son of God. Turn this stone into what? A blood. Why are you confessing what you are not calling? What sustains Jesus is what you need. Stop following Jesus traditionally. Follow him spiritually. Let religious people follow him the way they want to follow him. 
Because they are not the partakers of these blessings. Even the people who crucify Jesus, where, you know, I don't know if I can call them uh, children of God or what. Elders of the church, the high priest. To the extent where the high priest, this is blaspheming, challenging your creator. A blind leader cannot perceive what can save him and save his family. He would rather go to the mouth of Satana than standing in the presence of God. God does not know you through your mouth. He knows you through your heart. It is your heart. To every. A lead of the church. We proof you are strong and you only push a question. You have a Sunday school. Sunday school, every day push a question. We are not making a quality. We are not making a quality. We are not making a quality. Sunday school, every day push a question. One one question from Jesus, because when I believe on fear, believe Jesus. I believe on fear. Come on, answer me. Jesus. I believe on fear. I can't hear you. Jesus, I love you. I'm passionate about love. I'm saying, hello, Brandy, you show our pella. Okay, Uluwa chola kwa John wa fumine kuisa. Kuvantu nangula kuri lesa. Balo lesia ni asanga nyama no. Tumwa suki apa pele? No, senko. Ngatwa chila. Lua fumine kubantu. Ababari ya pabala tupola mwabu. Nari unga tumwebe ati lua fumine kulilesa. Alala nda ati nishita mwamu sumine. Tumwebe sha tatuishi mitulea wa alanda wina. Aba kulubachiro nga nino. Nani wenga tungula? Wenga nga tabeishi weti ba tungulu la nani? A servant cannot be greater than his master. The people that you follow, you become, you know, you'll be like those people. If you follow Jesus, you'll be like Jesus. If you follow blind leader, you'll be like them. That is your choice. That is your choice. He came to introduce spiritual life to you apart from the flesh, flesh life that you know. He said, no. The way you are living here on earth, this flesh cannot overcome Satan. I am here now. See me, follow me, watch me up to the end of, you know, my journey. I'll be killed, but I'll rise again after three days. They killed the flesh as a sign of that this flesh is nothing, but they could not kill the spirit. This is where my argument is when you talk about taking the body inside the church. They never took his body inside the church. Even all the apostles who have died follow the Bible. They never took anyone to the church. Once you are dead, they will call you to go and bury you. Only David they have buried inside that a place. The rest of the apostles, once you are gone, you have got nothing to do with the church. It is now when you are still living here on earth. But all what people want is to respect them without honoring the creator of heaven and earth. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The angel attended to him. For what? To sustain him. To give him more support that you are not alone. Remember when Jesus went to the mountain with disciples, who appeared to him? Elijah, Moses, and who? For what? That's why Peter said, oh, master, this place is good. This place is nice. Nalakula maya ndayanga, yetatu. Imbienu. Imbiakwa Moses. Imbiakwa Elijah. Ngaye na Peter nishitala ndilati yesu. Aishibati nelaifi ya ndiri muri yesu. Umu akulala ala na inumu nakulaita shani. 
mpakanka benga Elijah na Moses. That's why he said, I'll be with you. Peter had temen with Jesus, he chakweba ti. If you are a lander, if you are no good. Now, Pamela, you are a movie. A movie will not come, movie will come. So, why can't I? Yes, Peter, you say, the poor left with an open deaf with it. To a conquer, one more bloody left for me. Could I end the patari patari? I have been in the wise of our police, why can't I pass them linger? Bonsawa Pepapano, there is a case here. Uh, all the members, you hear different confession. Officer, I was invited by my friend here. I didn't congregate here. Mm. I didn't congregate. I, I was invited at Navakwato Kulongana. In fact, Nanana Church to observe by Officer Kwati Fimwala and the film when those are the confessions you'll be hearing. Kwambo Chinjabantu. Eh, Ngaime? No, in fact, you want to watch the land party? Fisunkanye, how well? Na ine kai ribanje we refiati. In fact, no kubale lo shachwa no kubakono. But you promise me that, Pastor, whether they they want to kill you, anywhere where you go, I'll follow you. As long as it is not from the spirit, you are lying. This is why all the promises that you have made. Not even one you have fulfilled. All the promise you have made for God to say, Mwele sanka chite, finka chite, finka chite, finka chite, before you know it, you are chinja manu. Unless if the spirit of God is the one suggesting in you, you stick to that promise. Satan is always capitalizing on that one. You use your mind to follow Jesus. Use your heart. When you believe your heart, who receive the power of God. The way Jesus received the power of God. Are you there? Are you there? <laughs> How many believers here? Are we believers? Can I see your hand? The believers of Jesus. Uh, when everything is okay, we are all believers. When crisis come, ha, uh, statements, we could pay the Ine kuno ba nchi tego fe introduce no tonton kanya na le tonton kanya po na tifi fi le chiti kefi tefio because you are in the flesh. Peter was sitting down, warming himself. Na kutala le lo le shapa tadi na eva yeswa te ino po le fuila na ino po nde fuila. He was warming himself. Ah, this man too was with the man. No. I don't know what you are talking about. The same mouth. He went somewhere again. Continue homing. So another one said, this man too, even your language has betrayed you. Because umundunga wa sangwa na nkwesa na wa sumi na mudiena. Nefi alanda na wefi okala alanda. Peter said, hmm, kaleza kaningambe. I don't know this man. And yet, this is the man who promised Jesus that I will be with you. Jesus said, you deny me three times. And Jesus looked at him. He started crying. He said, look at me, I'm a fool. I promise my... You are not a fool. You are a human being. What can defend you and make you overcome this temptation or trials is the Spirit of God. Even Jesus feel that pain in his body. He said, Father, if you are willing, take this, take this cup away from me. But not by my will, but let your will be done. And the angel appeared to him. The Bible says, to strengthen him. Thank you, Lord Jesus. This is my message for you. I have a lot of scriptures. I don't want to load you with the scriptures. Because when you leave this place, you pack the Bible. This one is enough. It's enough. You like a phone, mm. YouTube, Facebook. At least when you do your Facebook, you can read this one. Amen. Mm. It's a gift. Uh, that is Easter package for you. We conclude everything by the grace of God tomorrow. When we, you know, we carry 
the declaration of Jesus home. And I want you to believe that anyone believes with his heart or her heart, you receive the fruit of Easter. You receive what? The purpose of you receiving the fruit of Easter is salvation. Nothing. I will be rich, not because I want to be rich, because of my salvation. And the people who turn against me to say, how come? Why is counting money? Why he has this? Why he has that? Why he has this? Why are you asking? When I was in the wilderness, we were not asking. A follower of Jesus is not a failure. A follower of what? Is not a failure. You may not see anything, I mean, anything today, but I can see something in the spirit. That gives me hope and courage. Even where people are mocking me or planning evil things, I see the support of God on my said, Ah, Father, they are equal to zero. One with Jesus is what? Majority. When you go, you know, in the spirit, you see your enemy talking about you. All their plans, you hear them, and God will give you the direct to say, Do this. Then you disarm them. Without talking to them, you disarm your enemy. Not if you are a fisherman, you are a fisherman. You are a fisherman. You are a fisherman. You are a fisherman. Allow the Spirit of God to fight your battle. Jesus did not fight his battle using his flesh. He allowed the Spirit of God to fight Satan and his activities. And you overpowered him and became, I mean, came out victorious. He said, It is finished. In Romans 10 verse 11, anyone that believes in Jesus shall never be put to shame. The scripture, you know, which was given to me, talked about Jesus. He said, I have been anointed to go and proclaim the kingdom of God. And to set free the prisoners. And to bring freedom to the oppressed. And to recover the sight to those who are blind. Not the physical blindness, no. Majority of Christians, including men of God, they are just carrying the record. They are just carrying what? This is why you see, uh, you go to the mountain, you say, the mountain, you you shout and shout. Satan will be laughing at you. Say, look at this one. Eh. That is not the way your father talk. When your father talk, we hear him. You are making noise. Finish your noise. We we'll follow you. Mwelesa apape na nafika ngani sala lunch paya. I will first toto until this problem is. I will never put food in my mouth until this problem is what solved. You start your fasting. First day, second day, why ma? Kalun shingwa kakuto alaika. Hey, not even a good dream. Only pythons are visiting you. Hmm? You are clocking uh, two days. The third one, a spiritual husband come or spiritual wife come, feed you, sleep with you. You wake up. Father, why? Why? What have I done? Take me. If you don't want me, take me. <laughs> And you are forgetting that there are people who are in the hospital. Others are in the oxygen. But if you are in the take me. Because you cannot answer me, take me. What kind of prayer is that? When you pray according to his will, he will send his angels to come and sustain you. He will transform you. You will be in the trance. 
without forcing yourself. Jacob atala ndati shamile kale kwa no mumpa ndoko abulo ali mwene sai na tindina nani na lesa takwabo kuita welesa fira itashani icha bapo namba 1 kumusumina waamba no kumulolela no mutima wonga chapa the lesson is for him now apa pena mwelesa icha laba na chibe apa pena na himinina ana ali minine you are lying. Unless if it is the spirit of God confessing that. As long as it's the flesh, you want to borrow the life of Anna to be your life? No. Anna went through a lot and she was more of God Almighty than the pain in the marriage. God remembered Anna through the heart. The man of God, Heli, confronted Anna to say, you are drunk. He said, no man of God. I'm praying to God Almighty. Then the Spirit of God ministered to Heli. Immediately, tell her that God has already answered your prayer. And it came to pass. How many prophets have you received? Not even one has come to pass. You are now doubting the, 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 the man of God. No. God is real. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Na but funda kale. No kuma mwe heda. Ngamule pepa mule msunkanya. No mwa mume nkopo. And mule msunkanya muli kumupashi. Ngoti muli kumubili. Pante oka mume nkopo. Elo ngami umai monistro kweyo. God bless you.